Hey everyone, welcome back to Unity Roundtable, a series where we discuss Unity-related news, tips and tricks, tutorials, and more. Last month, Unity attended SIGGRAPH, a week-long conference for computer graphics and interactive techniques where thousands of passionate innovators meet, share ideas, and learn from each other. Over the course of the week, Unity unveiled some of their work through a series of talks, courses, technical papers, and demos at their booth. They discussed everything from technical updates and hyper-realistic digital humans to advances in real-time rendering for games, solutions for virtual production, VFX, and so much more. Here are some of their highlights. They premiered Lion, their latest demo featuring Wada Digital, a VFX studio that was recently acquired by Unity, and the work of the Monster Emporium Animation School. This demo features innovations in real-time technology through content created collaboratively for the first time across Wada Digital, Ziva, SyncSketch, Speedtree, and the Unity graphics team. This underscores what's possible when all these tools work together, simulating real-world measurements using the biomechanical elastic body solver in Ziva VFX for soft body dynamic simulation, an environment featuring vegetation from Speedtree, Weda Digital's hair and fur groom tool known as WIG, which is currently in pre-alpha, and real-time production through teamwork made possible by Sync Sketch's visual collaboration tool. The machine learning artistry team won the Audience Choice Award during the real-time live event. The Unity Labs ML artistry team presented AI and physics-assisted character pose authoring, which won the audience vote for new research on character animation and posing through machine learning. The tool showcased enables Unity users with minimal artistic experience to leverage both machine learning and a physics engine to author natural-looking poses in seconds. The enemies demo was enhanced using Ziva's powerful facial animation software and a new strand-based hair solution, which you can now download as an experimental package. See my Unity 2022.2 update videos for details on that. Unity demonstrated the real-time animation workflow for enemies, as well as Unity's latest advanced for creating digital humans. In the live session, they exhibited the quick editing process behind enemies' protagonists' facial performance in Maya with Ziva's control scheme to instantly deploy the new performance in Unity. They then swapped the protagonist to a different character to emphasize the extent to which Ziva can address key data. I've linked to the making of enemies video in the description. Unity launched Ziva Face Trainer, or ZFT, which is their latest tool for rapidly creating 3D human and character facial animations. They highlighted the newly released auto-rigging solution for RT3D faces, the benefits of ZFT's deep learned parameter space, ARKit, and expression controls. They also ran a three-part advances in real-time rendering course that covered production-proven techniques for the interactive rendering of complex and engaging virtual worlds in video games. I've placed a link to that in the description as well. During a fascinating technical paper review, the Weta Digital team introduced Loki, a new framework for robust simulation of fluid, rigid, and deformable objects. Their second paper then focused on a physically-based simulation method for bubbles and foam with white water effects. This makes the bubbles appear more naturally connected to the underlying water without the need for excessive expert parameter tuning by artists. And finally, they allowed visitors of their booth to experience firsthand their upcoming artist tools and workflows, exploring the latest solutions for efficient creation and collaboration. You can try a few of these now through the link in my description, but there are a lot more to come. Make sure to check out all their live sessions in the playlist linked in the card and in the description below. And that's all we've got for you today. If you like this Unity Roundtable update, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. You can join the Dummy Army by supporting me on Patreon, and you can also join us on Discord via the links in the description below. Thanks for tuning in, see you in the next one.